The race in the NL West division is heating up between the Rockies and Dodgers. Walker Buehler coming off his best start of the season. Eight scoreless innings against the Cardinals with nine strikeouts. Let's pick it up, bottom two. Rockies up 2 nothing. Matt Kemp facing Tyler Anderson. Lifted to left field, and Parra won't even move. Long gone to open the scoring on a Kemp home run. 2-1 game here in the second. The National League high 30th allowed by Anderson. Uh, one two again gets some swinging. It's on the doorstep of an eighth strikeout through four innings here. One short of his career high already. Mueller's matched a career high with nine K's tonight. At the knees to get him and Mueller's got his first double digit strikeout game as a big leaguer. We go to the bottom of the fifth. The Rockies a two to one lead. That side of the infield is essentially straight away for Brian Dozier, who drills one to left. A long run for Carr. He can't get to it. And is on his way home. Throw to the plate, and he is safe with a head first slide. A double for Dozier. And the Dodgers have tied it at two. Fastball, I mean, same location, same idea, but 98, same result. A 12 strikeout night for Walker Bueller. Strikeout number 12. Got Ober comes on to pitch for the Rockies bullpen in a tie game in the seventh. Second and third. Those are being called back for Yasiel Puig to get hit. Drilled to left center field. It's Puig's turn. A three run pinch hit home run for Yasiel Puig. Flexing his muscles as he rounds third and heads for home. 420 feet worth of pinch hit, three run home run by Yasiel Puig, who just received the curtain call. Yasiel Puig, the hero, as the Dodgers beat the Rockies 5 2. With the win, the Dodgers stretch their lead in the NL West to two and a half games, while the Rockies stay a game and a half behind the Cardinals for the second wild card spot. L.A. has taken 12 of 19 from the Rockies this year. Tyler Anderson gets the no decision despite only allowing two runs on three hits in six innings of work.